Hello guys, today we learn how to pass data from controller to view using viewwag in sv.net mvc5. You have required Visual Studio 2015 mvc5 version. There are many ways we can pass data from controller to view like viewwag, view data, theme data and session. Here we can discuss about viewwag and how can we use. Let us see. Viewwag uses the dynamic features that was added in CSR 4.0 versions. Passing data from controller to view and pass data view to view, we can achieve using Viewwag. Basically, Viewwag is used to transfer temporary data from controller to view, and it is a dynamic type property of the controller base class which is the base class of the controller class. In head example, we can see, like you can see that is controller, here I am written viewwag dot message dot message. In place of message, we can put any value and like take equally welcome. And in uh, that controller view, we can simply write viewwag dot message whichever i have written message so that value show in the view let us see in the project open one projects and this is a empty project for mbc now i have to create controllers click on add method and click on controllers here i have taken mvc5 controller input and place at and i have put a home name of the controllers and click on add button let us see our home controller will be created with index method now i am to use here now i want to use here viewwag so for viewwag simply i have write view bag dot put here message or you can put any name abc so whatever you put here you have to call by this id in the view let us see i have simply put view back that message equal i have read write welcome to view by so simply I have write view wag dot message in the index method of the home controllers. Now I have to add view for this action method. Click on write index method and click add view. View name index and I have taken use layout property blank included in this and click on add buttons. So you can see here for home controller index method index.chtml which created and you can write here like how to use viewwag now you can see here home controller in index method view dot message so simply in index at the data put viewwag dot message whatever you have written id and this will display the message what you have written in the index method now run the application so you can see here message will be printed here welcome to view way now second way here we use model to pass data from controller to view let us how can achieve let us see open projects solution and go to models click on add class now put here emp show model class and click on add buttons emp show class will be created here now i have created two properties property two public property like imply name and their cities now i assign the value in the controllers 
go to controllers and make object of imp so 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 that we can assign the their value so put here emp show object emp equal to new emp show and semicolon now i have to add here name is for, for for this now i've created now assign the value object emp dot imply name i have put john and city imply city i have put here london so i have assigned two values name and their city for the single imply and after that we have to return that object in the view now value will be in a slide here now i have to want to use this value control value in the index so go to index first we have to copy name space i have copy then go to index view at the rate of put model then use this dot models dot what whichever i have created the model class so am by so now how can you use let us see i put here model dot imply name imply name put here like imply name lab, label and take a break and second one imply city and put here model dot emp city now run the application we run the application you can see the value which coming from the controller via the model let us see so you can see here imply name john and imply city london there that line will be added in this line so we can make one breakpoint put here one breakpoint or two breakpoint and you can see refresh the page only now you can see imply name john and imply city london now you can see here there is one single imply and their value now i want to show collections of imply list of imply from model using model through the controller to show in view let us see so i have made one more action method to show the list of employee now we can show here another way to show the list of employee in previous example only i have show single data pass from controller to view now let us see define a index method like list of imply now put here return view for this we have defined list because you you have to show collection of imply so define list uh, here model imply show make object emp object emp and new list emp 
and curly braces new imply show and define the value like imply name john imply city daily first imply imply name john v and their city mumbai also you can one or two three four more more implies you can define here like john c and implies it is punjab and now also i have to pass this object in the view so that collection will be displayed in the view so i have to add list of imply so i have to add view for this uh, method click on this and click add button so this view has been created for list of imply action method now i have to write code here to display uh, you know that that is a collection so i have to use i never will so for this i have right here like simply first you have put model take smalls and take a name space like this one put dot dot i have to take model property and then imply show basically that is collection so i have to use i name rebel so take from here i name rebels and put this one Just now you know that is collection so put here model for each loop for display for each put here where item in models and put this one like at the rate of item dot emp name at the rate of item dot emp ct and also you can define a label like emp name put one paragraph here p copy and closing of this paragraph emp name same you can put here emp ct and emp name now run the application so you can see list of imply can is displayed here like imply name john's city daily john b mumbai john c by city punjab you can display in your way like headlines and their values now in next steps i have to show how to pass data view to view let us see here that is the view of list of imply so simply i have seen here view back dot title i change some name here like list of imply from hr department so by showing this simply put on br here and at the rate of view back whatever i have used and put dot title so you know view back is a dynamic property so it can be taken value from there so now run the application great you can see here list of employee from hr department so in this video here we see different way we can pass from data controller to view and view to view like first i have used view back second i have used model by single 
where to show also a so list of imply by defining this way and also i have used share for data between view to view like i have defined view back page title and view back page title whatever i have written here like view back title list i'm imply from a chart department i simply I put view back thanks for watching if you want to view more videos please subscribe my youtube channel